WTFNN. Headline News Update. Hi everyone, Basil Chapman here. This is the Tiger Technicians Hour coming up within a few minutes. But first we're going to do the update to TFNN noontime price. You're looking at the Dow up 60 at 28,576. All time high is 28,608. It should get there within the next couple of days. And then we're going to see what happens going into uh, the beginning of January. You've got the S&P at this particular point up a little bit better, actually. Uh, Boeing is hurting the uh, Dow a little bit. Um, you finally got that leg. Well, I'm going to call it a leg C for now, but it could be an alternate count. Meantime, back of the ranch, all-time highs in the S&P up 10 at 32.33. The QQQ also index 100 up sharply. Yep, I have to call that a leg C. So we're looking at uh, it can't be until early next week that we actually make that leg D. And at 213.18 up a dollar 26. This is very good action in the daily. It is excellent action in the weekly and the monthly chart is huge in this leg C. So, so far, everything looks good. And we should still make in 2020 a leg D to the upside in the NDX 100. The IWM is down six cents at 166.60. Sometimes it leads and then it has to take a breather. It's in that leg D in the Chapman Wave methodology. We're always looking for the fourth highest uh, peak. That's D. That's where other things can happen. So far, so good. Oh, but it's gold. Gold is just spectacular. Up another eight points today, 15.13. What a big move. Trying to make a cup formation, getting to at least the left side high in the 15.28 area. Let me see exactly what it is. It would be 15. 26 to 28. It's right now at 1513. Leg D, very good. MAC D is good. Stochastic is good. Silver, well, of course, led the way the other day. Remember, we saw silver up huge. Silver's giving back some of the gains, but still up 0.09 at 17.94. And this is a leg B. And it's going towards the 1840s, which would be a target for me. Um, very nice action. The dollar, funnily enough, the dollar right now is holding quite well. It's down 10 ticks at 97.56. But that is good. I don't know what this crazy leg down is from Friday. That, that, that is weird. I think that was an aberration. And what's interesting here also is that crude oil has gone to the extra uh, leg to the upside. It's in leg D at 61.68. I'll talk much more about it when we get back for the Tiger Technicians Hour. That's my show, noon to 1 p.m. each day. Stand by. Hope to see you then. Otherwise, have a great day. See you tomorrow.